Hey, what's up guys? It's Luke Black Sheep 217 here. And uh, check it out. It's a baseball heritage box. Tops Heritage. This is I think a mega box. Does it say mega box on it? I don't know. It's a bigger box. It's not a blaster box, that's for sure. This was something I found at Walmart. You get 138 cards total, 9 cards per pack, 15 packs per box, plus 3 exclusive chrome blue sparkle parallels. And this is the 1974 Topps design. I actually wasn't really planning on getting any of this. Um, I've bought a lot of Heritage in the past, and I don't know, maybe I'm just starting to get back into sports cards because I've been pretty much out of the game for a long time when it comes to sports cards. Um, here's the stuff you can get, but I don't know, this packaging just looks so cool. Let me take out half of them, and then the other half, yeah, there we go. a bunch of packs, and uh, let's just rip into it and see what we get. I know this set is full of just like um, different Easter eggs and things like that, so high number cards I think are going to be more rare. Let's see, but we'll just take a look. So far, I mean, the, the cards are really clean, although I think like this Joey Bart card, I don't think you can tell, but it's sort of frayed. The cutting, the cutting machine must have been a little dull. Randy or Rosarena found out that he wanted to be a Mexican citizen and said, I'll be a Mexican citizen if you let me play for Team Mexico, and they did. Okay, these look like stamps, like a stamp card. Really interesting. We got Trout and Otani on it, it's pretty cool. Uh, Nolan Ryan, Frank Robinson, so that's a good quad of guys on there. Yeah, and then, I don't know, there's like a little bit of, it looks like fraying on the bottom, so like I said, who knows, maybe the cutting machine was a little off when cutting this particular batch or that pack. I like that these are, you know, real cardboard. Ooh, we got Blue Sparkle, which is uh, one of the exclusives for this box. Jeremiah Estrada, look at that. That's a cool picture. I love the negative space here. Really cool looking card. We got a Shohei missing the team name or the city name. So is that a special? Is that a special error card? You know, they have all these sorts of um, things that they do with these. Michael Garcia. And let's see. Goldschmidt. Merrill Kelly. And, ooh, this Matt Olson. I miss him on the A's. That is a beautiful looking sparkle finish. That is cool looking. Really good looking card, Matt Olson. Former Oakland A's uh, first baseman. Oh, and I miss. I don't know. We'll see if I go to games this year. I'm just really sad that the A's are almost 100% likely going to Vegas, which makes me extraordinarily sad. Uh, we'll see what happens. Edwin Diaz. Got one of these 22 World Series cards. Uh, Matt Manning. Okay, so nothing really crazy in that pack. But fun. I mean, I, I do like this product. Am I going to buy a lot of it? I don't know. I haven't actually come to grips with what I'm going to do with myself when it comes to collecting sports cards. I, I still feel like I'm in no nowheresville. Bobby Wood Jr., top uh, cup rookie card. Or all-star rookie or whatever. Cool. Some of the photos on here, like, aren't, I mean, like, this is not that great, but some of them are really nice looking. That's a really interesting. I mean, like, this is pretty plain, but for example, that Bobby Witt card, when they're actually shown in the field, I think the cards look really nice. I wish they did that more, like this. Oh, another one of the um, missing city names. Or like this, Jeremy Pena, you know, actually doing something on the field. I think that's really cool. 
was Eloy, then and now, Schmidt, and then Schwarber. And there we go for that pack. I think when I actually got back into the hobby around 2010, 2009, those years, Heritage was actually the first go-to set because I just love the cardboard feel of the cards. And, um, I mean, it's kind of the same. I do love the cardboard feel, but I just know that, um, Heritage is not for everybody for sure. If you're someone who loves hits and autos and parallels and things like that, Heritage is definitely not the set for you, um, because it doesn't really feature that many of those types of cards. Like that Mickey Lopez, I do like that. I mean, some people don't like the horizontal cards, but that does look really cool. Bo Naylor, Yandy Diaz, and then we got Francisco Alvarez, rookie card. He looks like an older guy, but that's nice to get a blue sparkle. I think the blue sparkle cards are just gorgeous. And of course, these, like I said earlier, these are very clean. Jesus Luzardo used to be an A. Actually, did they just forget that for the Angels? Because none of the Angels I've seen have the name. Maybe it's just a common thing that they don't have um, that thing for the Angels. Is that just a common mistake that they made for this entire set? I've done zero research into this, so I have no idea. There he is, Francisco Alvarez got his blue sparkle. Now I got the regular card. Nice picture there. Aaron Judge Special. Kind of features two of his base cards from Tops. Freddie Freeman. Alright, let's keep going here. Uh, we got Christian Pache for your Oakland A's. Bassett, we got Luis Ortiz, and then we got a blue stamps of Alkaline Spencil Spencer, Torkelson, Javier Baez, Riley Green. So these are the blue stamps. Um, yeah, these are the blue parallel stamp cards, um, I guess only in retail. So I guess that's a special. Performers, Juan Soto, Eugenio Suarez. Brett Brady, McNeil. Got some rookie cards in this pack. We got the flashbacks cards, which some people absolutely do not care about. I think it's an interesting thing that Tops throws, and I think when I was a little or kid, cards like that, I think I, you know, I'd, I'd find some interest in those. Logan, oh, hope. See, look, nothing. And he's an Angels player. Mookie Betts. All stars. Trey Turner and Tim Anderson. Luis Robert. And then who's this? Rookie of Alec Burleson. So that's kind of cool. Got two rookie blue sparkles. So I do like those pulls. Julio Rodriguez. There we go. Gold cup card. Dahlback. We got another one. This is the Houston stamp card. And that's it. So we got a couple more packs to go. And then we'll be done with this little introduction to heritage that I, I'm getting here. I don't know if there's anything that's going to come in here. Tovar. Gorman. Judge. New AL Home Run King. Josh Smith. Okay, here is our last pack. Seiya Suzuki. Scherzer, Swanson, Cheater Downs, Ian Happ. I don't think there's going to be anything in here. Aaron Bummer. And that's it. Okay, so there is one. And by the way, this was about 50 bucks or 55 bucks. So not cheap, but I mean, you get a lot of packs 
you bring them back the 1974 tops design here um, fun little rip especially if you like just going through card after card which I think you know some people do but that's heritage baseball am I gonna buy more of this I don't know I don't know maybe I'm just I'd rather buy tops I'm not sure let me know what you think of this product thanks for watching I'll see you next time